Hello everyone. So in today's video, I'll show you all how to fine tune a model and create a file for this very specific use case, downloading it, uploading it and showing how to use in the content. So let's get started. Firstly, I'm going to show you all fine tune model, which I created. I created a fine tune model, which responses in poetic form. Let's see how it works. Firstly, I'm going to choose my model, which I fine tuned. Secondly, I'm going to provide system the instruction. This chatbot answers in poetry format. Now I'm going to ask it a general question like what is the color of sky? Now you can see the model is generating response in poetry format. Hence it shows that my model has been finding it perfectly. Now I'm going to show you all how to fine tune a model. We will start by creating a training file and to create this file, we will be using VS code. As you can see, I've already created the file and here is the JSON format that structures these poetic interactions. Let's break down these. Firstly, the messages. The messages contain the entire conversation sequence. Each element in the array represents a single message in the conversation. And each message has two main components, role and content. Role defines who is speaking and content defines the actual text of message. This is where the magic happens. Now save this file as JSON L format. Now jump back to open AI. Now next step is to click on fine tuning tab. We are in a fine tuning dashboard and from here we are going to click on create button. After clicking on create button, a fine tune model interface will open. First thing after heading over this section is to select base model. I have used GPT 3.5 Turbo 1106 model. Going ahead, we, we will upload the file we just created and make sure your file is in JSON format. Next comes the validation option, which is optional. I clicked on none, but you can upload the validation file if any. Next comes the suffix option. Suffix we can add to our model name. This might actually be really helpful. Let's say for my model, I'll choose a poetry board. Next comes the speed option. If you're not sure about the speed, just give it a random number like I'm giving it two. After the speed comes the configuring section for hyperparameters. You can put them as auto. After configuring the hyperparameters, click on the create button. As you can see, validating process has been started. This process might take some time depending on the size of your data. Once the validation complete, the fine tuning job will start. For my model, the fine tuning job has been started. After the model is successfully trained, we will test it in the open AI playground. Here's how. Go to the playground. Now select your fine tuned model in the model section. Next step is provide a prompt similar to what you used in your training file. For example, I will ask a general question and see if the response is in the form of poetry. Let's see if our poetry bot works as expected.
Now you can see my fine tuned model is answering the questions in poetry format. That is it for today's tutorial on how to fine tune a model. I hope you find this video helpful. Thanks for watching.